Oh, I'm gonna go see if I can find this guy. Oh god. Oh. I hit him. I got him. He's dead. That was just ridiculous chaos. Oh, I'm getting shot. Ah, I'm hit. Oh. Okay. I'm good. It's been a while, guys, but I'm back in Shinaris and we're gonna continue the journey today. Um, so Reese and I went through a little bit of a patch after we left the other guys at the other camp that we were at near Berezino. I've been having thoughts about it actually. It didn't end well for Reese. Um, unfortunately he had to take that guy out. The friend came back around and, and got him. Um, when we woke up the rest of the gang was gone so we had to move on. I, I've moved actually inland a little bit. I'm not at the coast anymore. I'm actually near Novi um, and I've got a little bit more gear since since you saw me last. Um, I'll take you through my gear now actually. I've actually got myself uh, a Mosin, which is really quite nice. It's got a long range scope and uh, the ghillie wrap or the grass wrap. I've got a fair amount of food on me, got a backpack, some other bits and bobs. I lost the improvised backpack. Fortunately when we left the other guys we woke up and most of our stuff was gone. They left us a couple of bits and bobs but, but not much. And it's still night time now so I think I'll have a little pace around and then we'll we'll move off in the morning see what we can uh, get up to ah oh, the rain started but it is morning now I'm gonna pack up the fireplace and then get going should have mentioned as well I've got a crossbow had that lent up against the tree. I think I've only got one bolt for it though. Uh, let's just have a quick look here. Yeah, I do only have one bolt. And the scope is pretty badly damaged, but it will take out a zombie in in one hit. So we're going to start making our way to the northwest a little bit to check out the airfield. Um, I've heard there's some survivors lurking around up there, so we should hopefully be able to make contact again. Um, and I don't want it to be hostile contact. Um, but that town we can see there is Novi Sabor. So you can see that I've come quite a long way since the last video. And I think I'm actually going to skip right past Novi and Starry. And then hit those on the way back. So we're going to head straight around these across this direction. In fact there's Starry right there across so you can see the warehouse. And then we're going to head through Cabanino towards Vibor and then northwest and then we'll come back this way before heading south again. I do plan to see the most, uh, well, most of Shinaris in my series. I don't know what those buildings are down there. Um, but the reaction so far to the journey has been pretty good. People seem to be liking it. Um, Oh, and if you're not sure how to make the, the ghillie wrap that I've got on my gun, as you can see there, you need a few things. You need a burlap sack, a knife. Uh, what you do is drag the knife onto the burlap sack in your inventory and cut it into strips. I think they're called burlap strips. And then once you've got the strips, you go up to any area like this on the ground with the strips in your hand, and it will say add grass. You then add the grass, and then you can attach that onto your Mosin. And uh, I think it looks pretty cool. You can see it looks quite cool on the, on the gun there. The only thing is... Uh, at the moment on the patch I'm playing, it's only uh, it only it bugs out your gun. So if you're laying prone, looking down your scope, you can't shoot. You'll get a constant hitbox on the ground, and that's to do with the ghillie wrap, I think. Just spotted a buck. Don't know if I have the don't have any utensils to actually cut it. I don't know if the hatchet will do it makes me think that I should look for a knife. I'm going to take a risk here and see if the hatchet will, will do what I need it to do. So I'm going to take this buck out. It's really pretty. I feel bad for doing it, but we got to eat. I've got to eat.
unfortunately it doesn't look like it. Which means I'm going to need to find some kind of sharp utensil to come back here. So I think I'm a bit lost. I was definitely heading towards towards uh, Cabanino, but I'm not sure where I am now. There's like a radio tower up there. The rain stopped as well, if you hadn't guessed already. It's quite sunny now, actually. I just saw another buck along there, but I'm definitely lost. Maybe I should go towards that radio tower. I might be able to help me out a little bit. Plus, I shouldn't really be in the middle of the field. It's not good to do that when I'm on my own. Oh, there's a road here. Wait, actually, I think I... Did I cross the road? Maybe I'll follow the road down this way, see where it takes me. That radio tower, I've seen that before. I think I've taken a real wrong turn, and I think when the rain stopped, it kind of messed my navigation up a little bit. So, I'll go into this forest here, follow the road, um, see if there's anything. Looks like it carries on going straight down this way anyway. So, yeah, I'll carry on following this road, see what we come up with. I uh, got into a bit of a scrape with a couple of zombies as well. I'm healthy again now, but it says in the bottom left that my leg is painful, so I've got to keep an eye on that. I guess it means my leg isn't quite broken, but is going to break soon, maybe. Or if it takes any more damage, it will break. Um, yeah, there you go, my leg is painful down there. So I've only got one splint, uh, sorry, one rag left. I, I picked up a bandana. Uh, earlier on and I used that to bandage myself because I was completely out of rags so hopefully if this road does lead me somewhere I'll be able to find some some more bandages Gorka? Really? I made it all the way to Gorka? Bloody hell I really did make a wrong turn in. That's like north of me where I wasn't Novi It's like north of where I started. I must have kind of done a complete circle I must have gone right through the middle of Starry and Novi. I know they've changed the terrain a bit, but I didn't. Yeah. Obviously, I'm not as good at navigating I, as I thought I was. But we'll head into Gorka. I'm going to go up through this tree line now. From playing the mod a lot recently, I've realised that tree lines and bushes are your friend. Otherwise, you get yourself into a whole world of hurt. So, we've been here for a little while now and we haven't seen anybody. So I figured what I'd do is go down to the wall, follow it around to the left. So yeah, I'm going to do that now actually. Why am I walking? Oh, that's because I was crouched this way. So I'll stay crouched just in case there are any Zeds here. Because the Zeds definitely like to hang out in these uh, compounds. Think. I think we would have seen anyone if they were here. Oh, I didn't realise there was a massive gap. I thought this wall went all the way around this compound. I haven't been to Gorka in a little while actually. So My leg is still painful. Maybe painkillers helps with that, with that message. I don't know if it's got any kind of debuff properties to me at the moment. But just checking that barn there to my right. Doesn't look like there's anyone in there. There's only no Zeds, so I think there's definitely been someone here. Because there are no Zeds anywhere around here. Not in the town, not in this compound. Not even in the fields approaching it, sort of thing, from, from the way I came in that direction. So I think we're good to go in. So as I headed down to the police station, I heard something behind me. And there's a plate had just come out of that wooden barn. probably gone into the red roof I guess didn't look armed or at least he wasn't holding a gun so let's approach hello 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 are you friendly yeah I'm friendly dude I've only got a hatchet okay can you hatchet. can you just put it on your back and then come out the barn please I've got a gun, but I don't want to shoot you. No, I saw him. Come out, come out the front of the barn. Whoa, 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 whoa. put the hatchet away. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm pinning away, pinning away. Oh, well, put your fist down, man. How's it going? Yeah, it's going alright, man. I'm just looking for a bit of loot. I uh, don't suppose you got any food oh, on you. Dan! Don't worry. Is that you, Dan? Oh, oh, oh shit! Geez. It's Dan. Look at you. You're playing as a female. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I confuse people that way. Has I didn't, I didn't know you were playing. Did you join my server? No, I didn't actually. I just got Faye. It's weird. Interesting. What are the chances? That's really random. But anyway, what you uh, where are you headed to? What's that, fun? Where are you headed to? I'm out with Dan. That's so random. Basically, sprinting from Berenzino because it's quite heated down there. I don't know if you knew, but uh, head up here because I know this is the next good place for loot. Uh, I'm just trying to find some gear because I said I haven't really been anywhere with major loot. And I've been practically dying of starvation, but I'm alright now. I found some rice, but. Uh, I'm probably just going to keep heading up north, if I'm honest. Okay, cool. Well, yeah, should we... Do you want to tag along with me? Because I just came down... I just came this way from Novi, but I, I was planning on going uh, towards the northwest airfield, but I got a bit lost. So, do you want to head with me? Yeah, sure, man. I'll tag along. We'll clear out this town of these Zeds up here down on the road, and then we'll head out. But just so you know, there's some rules that I, I follow. Uh, quite basic at the moment. It's if we see a player, uh, and they're on their own, or we, they look as if they're on their own. We'll uh, we'll try to interact with them. We'll go up and say hello, see if they're friendly. Um, generally, from experience I've had so far, they'll want to tag along. If we see a group of players, depending on the situation, depending where they are, we will avoid them as best we can. Yep. Um, if they engage us, we will do our best to defend ourselves. I'm gonna try and take this zombie out, buddy. Okay, you don't get the bolt back. Oh, what, once I kill it? Yep. Well, that's not going to be worth doing then, is it? Might as well save the bolt. Something a bit more useful. You're going to sand fish with this bitch. I am. I'm going to just take him out, mate. He's not even going to see me coming. Watch this. He's just going to be completely oblivious. I call it the deadly sneak attack. Do it. Nice. That was pretty good, actually. I enjoyed that a lot. That's how I do it around here. How have I aggroed one? Look. He saw you. What? He saw you kill his buddy. I'll get him. Mate, he's a monkey, this one. Watch out. Oh, I'm glad you got him. Good job. It's alright. Let's go into this building. This is a medical building. Oh, there's the there's the pump that ran into the church there. You did say you thought there was a pump around here, didn't you? What? Can we go in here? Yeah. He said this is a medical storage building. Oh, is this... Oh yes, I was talking about this earlier. Um, one of the most useful items you can have is alcohol tincture. Um, if you ever, if you get bad, if you get bandages, um, and they are ruined, um, you can make them so they're not ruined with alcohol tincture. Oh, awesome! Yeah. And you just got one. Yes. Oh. Oh, what's that? Is that warp purification? Oh no, painkillers. Yes. There's a uh, some saline bag here. I don't know how the yeah, pick a saline up, you need an IV kit. So I've just picked up these painkillers and it keeps popping up for me and saying that my leg is painful. So I'm going to eat these, see if it makes that go away. Hope so. Okay, let's head towards um, Novi, I think, because I skipped past Novi earlier on. Um, I think it's probably a good place to go. There's a police station there, so we might be able to find you a better weapon. Yeah, sure. And then we'll head into Starry after that. Um, and then I guess onto the Northwest Airfield. Well, I've we been will there in go a while. past the Cabanino military camp. Oh, That's similar. Yeah. I forgot about that. The uh, the one in the one near Vibor, between Vibor and Cap. Yeah. I forgot about that place. Yeah, it's probably quite dangerous there, so we can um, maybe we can watch from. Well I can, well, I can watch from the hills with my sniper, and we can head in. But hopefully, we can find a gun for you before then, so at least we're a bit more prepared.